Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I have a little name with me. A couple videos ago, I did like a life update and said, hey, I'm pregnant, which I hadn't even announced on YouTube. And now it's crazy that I have Hunter here on the video with me, but we are sitting in his nursery and I wanted to do a little mini nursery tour of his room. And it's really small, but I wanted to share some of the things that I'm loving and what the setup is. So if you want to see his little space, keep watching. Okay, so I opened up the window so we have a little bit more light, but I wanted to show you the room and some of our favorite things that we're loving in here. So when you first walk in, we have the dresser and the changing table. So in the corner here, I just have wipes, diapers that we refill, lotion, aquaphor, and the bumbo changing pad, which literally saves lives. And then here, inside these drawers are all of his clothes. Not super organized right now, but we have a sleep sack a bunch of onesies and sleepers, outfits, and then bibs, bandanas, which have been saving lives because he's spitty. And then just down here is some other outfits, beanies, socks, booties, and I change out his different outfits as he grows. And then this awesome area rug, I just think is a nice contrasting color. We have his little diaper pail that we can't live without. It's amazing, you can't smell anything from it. And his hamper, we call it the hunter hamper. And this green wall is like my favorite. It's our accent wall here that I just put some simple prints that I got from Hobby Lobby. Actually, my dad loved them and him wanted to put them up. And so they're adorable. Just have these, just fun and simple. And then here's the Delta crib that we have. Let me zoom out for you so you can see it a little more. It's beautiful, plain, simple, white. It's actually like, I think it can convert to four different modes. So like you can use it when he's a toddler too. You can take the sides down and then just a fitted crib sheet from Target and the Newton baby mattress, which is such peace of mind. And then the corner here, we don't have a ton of space for this room. So right now, since he's so little, he's not using a ton of toys yet, but here's his toy box, which I wanna get like a shelf or some kind of like toy area here later. And then a bunch of books down here in this box. But, and then we have our baby monitor, which I don't love this cord here, but that is where that lives. Love the VTech baby monitor. And of course the baby Yoda, the Grogu that Michael got from Costco when we found out we are having a boy. <laughs> so that is that situation here, his windows. And then we have the rocker recliner. Oh, we have a nice little like cup holder for our stroller in the corner randomly there. Okay, this is real life. <laughs> um, rocker recliner here, love it, so comfy. I nurse all the time from this chair. Um, it's just the nicest and it's so comfortable. And then down here randomly, again, real life, this is a bunch of his newborn clothes that don't fit him anymore, so that's fun. And then this is honestly such a fun little corner for me. It is a little nightstand that is just provides more storage. And then it can also house his hatch sound machine, which we love. It has amazing different modes. It is definitely something that I'd recommend getting. His humidifier and then a little jar of passies here. He honestly doesn't use passies all the time, but when he does, it's nice just to have that out and it's all cute. A little lamp for when it's late, when we're doing that last feeding of the night. And then this cart is saving my lives. I also need a power strip or like a cord organizer because that's just fun looking. But again, it's functional, it's real. This cart is really, really fun in my opinion and extra storage since it's such a small room, I wanna maximize all the storage. So the top part is his little bath cart. So we have his towels, um, washcloths, extra diapers, aquaphor, his little like bath cup, a vino. Um, this is the baby, let's see here. It's just like the oat, I think, one. The Call Me Natural Oat Extract one. Yep, I love this one. And then Johnson & Johnson, a little scrubby and a little hairbrush. And so that's the top one. And then the second row is kind of like his hygiene section. So it has like all the Frida Mom, like Frida Baby things, I mean. So like hygiene filters for the snot sucker, which some people like really dislike. But I love, it's super functional. Um, a thermometer, um, a gripe water for when he's colicky or just, um, just to have comfort in his stomach. Um, Nail file trimmer, which is amazing. You don't have to feel like you have to cut your baby's nails. Um, extra passies, um, and then also extra like little clips um, for the passies onto clothes. Um, another thing of wipes, and then down below is like miscellaneous at this point. Some random teethers, sunscreen, um, extra products, a fan for the summer, 
um, storage, like breast milk storage bags and all that fun stuff. And then if you turn around this way, this is just where the door is. And then here is the closet that actually Michael shares with Hunter. So it's like half is Michael's side and half is Hunter's side, which basically is just full of our maids of like other clothes. So I'm not gonna show you that. But that is just kind of the gist of his room. Okay, so this is his room. That was a little nursery room tour. I hope you enjoyed it. It was really fun to film. And I know I've been talking about doing a nursery video for a long time now that like have the camera and the whole setup. It was so much more fun to film. So if you like this video, make sure to subscribe. Let me know down in the comments below what you want to see as far as videos. I have a ton of video ideas, um, vlogs, day in the lives, routines, Bible studies, all the things. I am pumped to be back here on YouTube. So I love you. Thank you for watching and I'll see you later.